Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? Sure. Uh, let me just come on, you little bullshit! Oh, sorry. I've got a small fever and I'm taking it out on the poor drive core. Don't worry, it's nothing serious. Got sloppy while doing some suit repair. You're sick? Do you need help or time to rest? Really, it's not that bad. If a stray bit of bacteria could really kill us, we'd have all died by now. The fever should go away in a day or two. Don't worry, it won't affect my performance on the mission. It's not even an illness, really. What we experience is actually an acute allergic reaction. How exactly does the sickness work? It's an allergic reaction? Right. Say I get exposed to a human disease, like... What did Navigator Presley have that time? Chickenpox? I wouldn't get chickenpox, but I'd run a fever as my system reacted to the foreign presence. Depending on where it hits me, I could get other symptoms. Nausea, vomiting, everything you'd expect from being... How did you get sick this time? I took some fire in a fight back on the Alari. Nothing serious, but I needed to open my suit to check the wound. I disinfected properly, but one of the section seals had taken some damage, and foreign matter got out of the disinfected zone. It was a stupid mistake. You always check your seals before doing local treatment. Unless you forget. Then you get a damn fever. You can seal off part of your suit? Right. Like dropping emergency doors on a ship during a hull breach. It won't stop an infection that gets into my bloodstream, but it prevents a surface infection from spreading. Were your immune system stronger before the Geth drove you from your homeworld? Not as strong as those of most races, definitely. I'm not a biologist, but there's a theory about it. Because our planet lacked insect life, plants developed symbiotic relationships with large animals to spread seeds or pollen. Most viruses on our world were partially beneficial, so our immune systems evolved to be weak. They were more likely to adapt to contamination than fight it. But Quarians colonized other worlds. They couldn't have all been like that. They weren't. Most colonists went through a period of mild illness before adapting to the new environment. When the Geth took the homeworld and our colonies, the sterile environment on the flotilla ruined our immune system's adaptability. Even if we colonized a new world or reclaimed our own, we'd need a long process of bioengineering to recover. I don't know if I could live inside a suit my whole life. We are in our suits even among family. The most intimate thing we can do with another Quarian is link our suit environments. We get sick at first and then we adapt. It's our most important gesture of trust, of acceptance. I haven't trusted anyone enough for that though, except... Well, no Quarians. Um, you know what I mean. I appreciate the thought, Tally. And I feel the same way. But you don't have to prove anything to me. I know. Nevertheless, I'd be honored to link suits with you, Shepard. You know, if you were a Quarian and we weren't already on a suicide mission. I'm going to tinker a bit more. Thanks for coming by.